Hey everyone, Sun Tendaka here, bring you back another episode of The Legend of Zelda. <clears throat> Sorry about that. <clears throat> Let me try again. Of The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask for Nintendo 64. In the last episode, we not only completed Snowhead Temple, but took on the boss Goat. And that's about all we accomplished. Well, plus the great fairy as well. Anyway, that's about all we accomplished, and I just now realized that my Retro Fighters Nintendo 64 controller is lightweight as heck. I could probably break this if I wanted to, but no, I don't want to go back to the N64 controller. Sorry, N64 controller. You're still a decently good one. I was just, um, to my 64 controller. The official Nintendo 64 controller that's still a good controller. Gee enough. Anyway, I'm not dilly daggling. Let's get let's get this game started. Okay, first off. Let's use the um Songs are sorry. And head back to the mountain village. To be quite honest, I was um meant to um go back there and not in front of Snowhead, but I was tired in the last ep in that in the last episode I'm like I don't care where I save, I just wanna get somewhere to save. Okay, let's see, um Oh, that's right. It's about to be, um, dawn of the, the final day, basically. Let's see, I think it was this way? No, 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 no. No, we know I am going the right way. Let's see, can we get there? Let's see how fast we can get there in time. By the way, today is going to be... Oops. Oh wow, return back as Kid Link. Um, today is gonna be quite a collectathon. How dare you! Now let me kill my enemies! And here we are. We are now back. Ooh! That looked cool! The way how the tick. I call it a tic tac. Excuse me, I meant to say, um. Yeah, I kind of forgot what it's called now. Oops. No, no, no! What? Now's my chance. Tech type. There we go. I'm trying to figure out what it was called. And they'll die just the same. So, thanks to that Wolfles, which is now back to normal, um... The difference between the white one and normal, there's not much of a difference at all. They're just the same enemy, just different color palette. But one screw that wolf, that wolf falls. How dare it knock me into the water? Uh, I don't have enough rubies to do what I want to do with that merchant over there. Um, that merchant right there, if you're, um, now Goron Link, he will sell you, um, a bigger bomb bag for 2,000, I'm not 2,000, um, 200 rupees, but the first thing he offers you is, um, one, uh, is, um, yeah, 1,000 rupees, and I'm like, there is not enough money right there in this game. The max amount of money that I know of, oh, wow, frame rate issues again. First, you grope my left boob. Then, you grow my right boob. And now you're trying to lick my boob. Sir, you are a pervert. Oh, Darmani! I've been waiting impatiently for you. I've been waiting for your arrival ever since I heard the news. I have heard that you, the one who I once thought to be dead, had sealed off the blizzard that was blowing in from Snowhead. Thanks to you, spring has come to Goron Village. Everyone is pleased. 
The greatest Goron hero of all, that... Dormoni! The immortal Goron, who is not dead, even, even if he has died, that's... Dormoni! The star whom he wished upon, that's... Dormoni! Why is that one Goron not cheering? Cheer for me! Dormoni! Dormoni! Greatest of Gorons! Greatest of Gorons! Cheer for me, dang it! Dormoni is the greatest in the world! Greatest in the world! My son got better immediately. He went to see the Goron race that celebrates spring. This time, I, the protector of this tribe for so many years, choose to yield the seat of tribal patriarch to a younger one. The girl who makes claim decisions, yet boasting courageous determin determination and can take care of all of all sh shall be the, the patriarch. The chosen one, Dormani, is you. There can be no other. What do you think? If that's, if it's you, everyone would happily accept you as the patriarch. What? You need not answer. So quickly, go into the Goron race. Think it over slowly. I'm awaiting a thorough response. Oh, I thought he was um gonna go off to try to get to the race, but it's like, hee hee, it's already dawn on the final day, and it's like, yeah, he's not gonna make it. So, we have a little, um, side objective now, but there's a little area that's around here, and it's right over there. That area we could not get into because it was frozen solid. Even if you had the warm spring water. But now that it's all nice and warm again, we can now go in here. For the Goron who sells the powder cake, the most famous product of the Gorons. What's a powder cake? Powder cakes explode with powerful blast and are very dangerous. Until I have tested you to see if you can use them properly, I can't let you use them. Use any on your own. Will you try? I mean, will you give it a try? Now that I got much of a choice. Using the powder cake I'm about to give you, then I'll prove you to carry them. Oh, so... I guess what I originally thought was wrong. When the powder cake begins ticking faster, it means that it's about to explode. Try to blow up the boulder blocking Goron Racetrack entrance without the powder cake exploding on the way. There's a sign near the racetrack, so keep an eye out for it. When you're finished, come see me. Um, sir, wouldn't it have been a better idea for you all, oh, I don't know, to tell me about... To, um, tell me about... To tell me... Good. Wouldn't it have been better to tell me about this first before giving me the powder cake? No. Please, folks, do not put the powder cake down. It's dangerous. Oh. Time is about to come for the moon to crash again. But we have plenty of time. We have nothing but time. We got time to kill, 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 and kill. Uh, I think this is like a little sh short cut. Yep. A little shortcut. And we need a hurry. Oh, it's ticking a lot faster. And I kind of was thinking about originally, um, just cutting away to, and getting to the part, but I'm like, eh, in case someone's wondering where the heck I went off to while I was cutting away, they'll probably get confused and be wondering where the heck they're supposed to go. And by the way, I am preferring to new view people who are never played really come on go 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 
I'm almost there. No. Wait. Oh, good. And I'll just place you here. Hey, kid, what are you doing out here? Ah, they're money. No, wait, I got bear voice for him. <clears throat> now that's nice and warm out. I'm much, much better. Even if my dad isn't right beside me, I won't be selfish and cry. So, now that spring has come to the Goron braces, should be starting soon. But... But this rock is in the way, so I can't get in to see the race! And spring just started too! I was so excited, there's nothing I can do! I hate it, I hate it, I wanna see it, I wanna see it, I wanna see the race! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, sorry about that. You son of a bitch! Get back here. Okay, so the powder cake will probably go off any second, and probably three. I was getting the countdown started though. Now I'm sad again. Way to go! Wait. <clears throat> Way to go, Darmani. That was cool. Come on. If we don't hurry, the race will start. Come on, hurry. <coughs> I cannot seem to keep up that dumb voice I gave him for long. It really cranks the throat up quite a bit, actually. Anyway, after that, we're now going to go back. Actually, could this be a good speedrunning tactic? Oh, wow, that actually helped a lot. It saves on time, too, actually. Um, let's see, I, once again, I can't do anything about the uh, extra big bomb bag without getting 200 rupees, which, yes, I do have plenty of that money saved up. Well, I might need some extra on me just in case. You'll never know when you need extra. Oh, uh, by the way, here's evidence that the Goron cannot climb high cliffs at all. Boing. Boing. It lo looks like you managed to succeed in knowing your skill. I feel fine letting you handle powder cakes on your own. It was bad of me to put you through such a dangerous test. I want you to take this as my apology. You've got a powder cake. This here is basically a one-time bomb. Powder cakes are very violent, so you can carry only one at a time. If you shoot them with an arrow, they will explode as soon as they're hit. So, be careful. And because of that, we now have access to buying powder cakes whenever we please. But uh, right now, powder cakes are not going to be used much right now. I think there's like, they can be used as much as you want, but it's, you got to be careful uh, when and when to use it. Anyway, I think that's all I'm going to do for Goron Village. I'm going to give myself a quick drink real quick. <coughs> Excuse me. There, now clear up the throat a bit. Now, let's head back to Clock Town. Poof. So, the reason why I am now coming back to Clock Town again, we got ourselves some questing to do. Yes, we're going back to side questing. And the first side quest I'm going to take care of is this right here. Um, I did not show this off when we originally started the Let's Play. I do apologize about that. Well, aren't you a fifth fellow? Want to play? Only for 30 rubies. Man, yeah, sure, why not? If you can make it all the way to the treasure chest and open it within the time limit, I'll give you a special prize. Finding out what's inside is half the fun. Are you ready?
Ooh. This looks like a little simple fun game. It's not as simple. It is, it is not as simple though as it looks. Yep, we gotta play a little maze game. Oh, come on. Oh, come on. Oh, please, come on. Oh, come on. No, no. Come on, please, game. Well. I almost made it. Kinda. Okay, how about I try starting all the way in the back? That's why. It's a different store. It's in a different layout. Oh, come on. Come on! Are you joking? Not again. Arrow's trying to do something fancy, but guess not. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. I thought I could get... Oh, he's in the middle this time. I could get it if it's in the middle. Oh wow, that was easy. Oh hey, as they always say, say three times to charm. And your ward is another piece of heart. That is now, I believe, 11 pieces of heart that we have collected so far. No. Sorry to disappoint you, lady, but life's a butch. That's what my life has taught me. I mean, that's what my life has taught me that life is a butch. After all the mistreat me treatment you gave me as a dick of scrub, you better salute, or I will cut you. Okay, no, I won't actually go up and go. <laughs> okay, next up, we need to find a, a patch of grass with butterflies. Think. Um. I know it's close. Oh, whoa! That was cool, actually. Okay, it's around here, and there's butterflies. Nah, not gonna be much use later. Okay. Next up, we got to find the hole. I thought that would help a bit by... Come on, where is it? It's usually close by the... It was right underneath it the whole time. Look at me calling myself a genius and yeah, I'm a fool. A fool of a took. So right here we have a classic enemy. At least for 3D Zelda games. It's a P-Hat. The best way to really handle them is to... Get their mentionables. Yeah, I don't know what. Yeah, this one could be kind of tough because it takes up a whole heart. I could die, and people are going to call me a dummy here for doing this. 
Hey, look at that. I'm no longer that dumb idiot. Go on, victorious. Hear how victorious I am. Roar. Open up this chest. And unlike Sugar Conroy, who put in 11 out of 52, I'm putting in the rifle 12 out of 52. The only difference between mine and his, that is that his is more fancier with um, description how to get it than compared to me, where I just put the number in lazily looking. Okay, okay. I know I'm not as good as him, okay? You don't have to be so grudgy about it. Oh gosh, not him. No, I'm not letting him come after my stuff. Activate this owl statue. And it's majestic wings. How is these things here again? Um, I forgot what they're called. It's like my heart is being peered right into that a describing, disturbing eye. Oh, it's a Sheikah stone. Okay, never mind. I remember now. Let's bomb it. Three, two, one, blast off. That poor, poor, poor stone. I can't believe I had to put it to an end. Anyway, I think that's going to be it for today's episode. Next time on The Legend of Zelda Majora's Mask, we'll be heading into a well-known location in the game, technically about any Zelda game that this location has been in. If you all enjoyed today's episode, please share, like, subscribe if you want to, and I'll see you all for the next episode. Have a nice day.